as of yesterday, we have been able to vaccinate um, way over 3.6 million children, and that is 86% of the expected target. We expected to vaccinate 4.2 million children, and we aim to reach 95% by the close of business today. Uh, we urge the parents and guardians and caregivers in the targeted areas to bring unvaccinated children to the nearest health facility to meet our vaccinators and the vaccination team on the ground. And I want to assure you that all vaccines that are offered by the Ministry of Health are tested to be safe, effective, and they are approved by the World Health Organization. This vaccine is being used everywhere else in the world. So it is not just Kenya alone. And all vaccines in the country are tested by the National Quality, um, National Quality Control Laboratory together with Pharmacy and Poisons Board and have been found to be safe and very effective. And unfortunately, due to low routine immunization rates in some counties and polio outbreaks in neighboring countries, Kenya remains at risk at any given time. And that is why we are continually doing the oral polio vaccination because every dose means a lot. It, it adds an extra protection for any child who is below five years. Even if a child has received a vaccine, a, a vaccine during routine immunization uh, or two days before the campaign, uh, of the, uh, they can always be vaccinated again. Again, um, why we do this repeatedly and especially in our country, it is because our country has continuously confirmed polio outbreaks and because of our uh, borders, um, the influx of people from one country to the other. Uh, some countries continue to report low immunization coverages. That is uh, our, our, um, our, our, our neighbors. And uh, they report quite a number of outbreaks every now and then. Therefore, it is important that our children who are below uh, the age of five are vaccinated at any given time to ensure that they do not get the disease.